Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another video. Very glad that you are here. Today we're going to talk about how you've got to trust yourself and about how you can actually do no wrong. And of course, here's why and I'll explain what I mean by that. Everything that you've done in life so far has been for a reason. So every mistake or choice that you've made in your life has med led to an outcome. Whether it be quote unquote good or quote unquote bad, it's led to an outcome. From each outcome, whether you label it positive or negative, you've learned. So if you've made a choice in your life and it's led to a good outcome, you can trust yourself even more. And you think, oh man, I'm really feeling confident about my decision making and I feel really good about where I'm going in my life and what I'm doing, and you build this confidence and trust in yourself. Where I wanna talk about is when you've made a decision in your life and it has not led to the desired outcome. It's led to, quote unquote, a bad outcome. And with that bad outcome, and especially if it's in a series of decisions that you've made and it's led to a series of bad outcomes, you label yourself as you know or you lose confidence and label these choices as bad decisions or bad you know choices you've made but in reality there is no such thing as neither good nor bad choices they're just simply choices because every choice that you've made or decision you've made in your life that's led to a less than desirable outcome it's probably turned out to be one of the best decisions or things that could have happened to you or for you in your life, especially if it is a bad outcome or something that you didn't want. Why is that? Because you learned or hopefully you learned. And that's what it's all about. That's what this journey on life is about. It's about making decisions and trusting ourselves in each decision that we make and each outcome because if it's a good outcome, great you learned something about yourself and it led to a great outcome. But the real value is the lessons that we learn from the pain we experience from our bad decisions and undesirable outcomes. That's where the juice is, that's where the growth is. So how does this play into trusting yourself and that you can do no wrong? Well, you can do no wrong because if you made a decision it led to something good, well, great. You learned and it led to a great decision. But if you made a decision and it led to a bad outcome, you've learned. And the quote unquote worst decision you've made that led to one of the worst things that could have happened to you, I promise you, you've gained so much wisdom and growth and character from that bad outcome or situation. And it's led to an incredible amount of maturity character development, growth, and wisdom. And with that wisdom, you can now move forward and create something so incredible and powerful because that painful lesson or situation that you learned from, it's led to something incredibly great. When you look at some of these other interviews with these people who are incredibly successful in life, whether it's financially or with relationships, They've all said the same thing. I've been broke a million times. Yeah, I'm a multimillionaire now, but it's only because I failed at 18 other businesses and went bankrupt twice. So I learned from all those mistakes and here I am. And it's only because of those mistakes that I made did I gain the wisdom I needed in order to be the multimillionaire business owner I am now. The man or the woman who has been in a thousand relationships and been divorced twice and now is in the relationship of their dreams, it's because they learned about themselves and how they show up in relationships, the type of partner they were choosing, what they were doing or not doing, who they were being or not being in order to make those relationships successful. So this is all to say that you've got to trust yourself in every decision that you make and be confident and move forward and trust yourself that whether it's quote unquote a good decision or bad decision, that it's for a reason and that you are learning. Now, if you're watching my content, there is a spiritual undertone and context to a lot of the things that we talk about. And you understand that you are a soul having a human experience. 
that you are constantly in connection with your higher self, your oversoul, the best version of you that's living up there in spirit. We're basically in a simulation playing a video game and you're the character right now in the video game and in the simulation. simulation. And as you, if that resonates with you, and if that does resonate with you, let me know in the comments, you understand what I'm saying. This is vibrating with you. You're, you have a higher self, you have an oversoul that's directing you and guiding you to your absolute best life. So each decision you make as this human being here on planet Earth is actually being directed by your higher self. And we don't really know what's best for us. We can only speculate and think we do. So your higher self is leading you to these different experiences, decisions you're making. And whatever lessons you need to learn in life, you're being directed for that. And you will be a multimillionaire. You will be, you know, um, amazing uh, husband or wife or father or mother, whatever it is. But you may need to learn a lot of lessons in order to be prepared for what it is you're asking for. And so the decisions that you make being directed by your higher self may lead you down a pretty rough path. <laughs> a pretty rough and painful path. That's been the case for me, but only now can I look back and say, oh, I understand not only the lessons I need to learn in the past in order to be successful in the life I'm creating now, I needed those experiences to gain that wisdom. I needed that time to mature. I needed just like a fine wine, just needed that time in the cellar to mature. I wasn't quite ready yet, but now I feel that I am. And of course, I'll have a lot more to learn along the way but all these very painful experiences, especially the most painful I've had in my experiences where I've been like suicidally depressed and like dead broke and all these things, I needed those because man, the stubbornness in me, I needed to learn in such a painful, powerful way as to learn the lessons, to gain the wisdom to prepare me. So trust yourself in the decisions that you make and be confident whether the outcome is good or bad that it was the right choice to make. And the real juice is, the real growth is when you gain the wisdom from the mistakes that you've made, from the bad experiences, from the bad relationships, being taken advantage of. You didn't do anything wrong, that's exactly what you needed to learn, so that your skill and ability of discernment, of understanding people, of understanding yourself and how you relate to others, these interactions you've had, the betrayal, the you know, cheating on by a husband, a wife, a girlfriend, by the making all this money really quick and blowing it on a car and a bunch of crap you didn't need and now you're broke. You needed that because now all that pain, you're never gonna forget it. And so as you go forward, you can trust yourself that whatever's happening in your life is for a reason. The only thing that really hurts us is when we do not learn from the mistakes that we're making or the decisions we're making and the quote unquote undesirable outcomes and situations. That is really where the juice is. That is really where the power is. So if you're like me also and you're super stubborn, <laughs> which a lot of us are, you may need to learn the same lesson 10, 15 times, man. And it sucks until you finally get it through your head like me. And I'm like, oh, God, I get it. Okay. So the super, you know, hot chick with like 100,000 followers who's taking these pictures uh, of herself. You know, if that's you, it's all good. I'm not hating on you, just using it for example. Maybe she isn't the best relationship material for me. Maybe that isn't a woman who really loves herself even though she's super hot on the surface. And then I start dating her and then she's a train wreck and my life gets torn down because I get pulled into her web of like needing attention and love. Okay oh man, I had this great job and I made all this money and I bought a BMW that sure I could afford, but I wasn't quite established enough and I spent all this money on extra stuff and now I'm broke now. Okay, maybe that's not right, the right way to go about this. These are examples that I've experienced over and over and I'm like, okay, I get it. I get it, universe. I get it, higher self. I get it, God. I get it, angels. I get it, spirit guides. Like I've learned the lessons. And only in that maturity through experiencing this pain over and over in my teens and in my 20s and even in my 30s, I'm like sitting here now and I'm like, okay, man, let, let, let's reflect here. Let's, let's look at these things. And now with this maturity, this development, mentally, emotionally, spiritually, physically, financially, professionally, all these things, right? Can I now sit here and go, oh, I understand 
how I'm supposed to move about the world and learn from my mistakes in order to promote growth and move forward. So trust yourself in whatever decisions that you're making because whether it's good or bad, you're supposed to learn a lesson and the more painful the experience, the greater the lesson and you'll never forget. It will leave an indelible mark on your mind, your heart and your character. That is what is shaping you to be the best version of yourself. You can do no wrong because if you make a decision, it's great, great. You learn from it. But the more powerful lessons that you'll never forget are from the mistakes you've made in the past, from the quote unquote bad decisions, the painful experiences, the betrayal, that's where you'll really learn. So you can do no wrong because whether it leads to good or bad, you're either moving forward or you're quote unquote moving backwards, but that moving backwards, the bad decision is creating a valuable lesson and wisdom for you to grow and prosper as you move forward now. That's what wisdom is, that's what maturity is, that's what we're all doing. This is your evolution, this is your ascension, this is you creating the life of abundance, of love, of passion, excitement, of adventure, of health. This is what it's about. So the quote I leave you with today, I didn't write any notes uh, down, but I did look up a nice quote. If I could live my life over again, I'd make all the same mistakes, only sooner. And it, uh, it was from a woman named, I, I, I'm not even gonna say it, I can't even remember her name, I'll, I'll have to look it up. Uh, again, I'd never heard of this woman. It, it seemed, she had like a picture from like the 30s or the 40s or something, it was like in black and white. But I just looked up that quote and I thought it was so great and exactly what we're talking about today. If I could live my life over again, I'd make all the same mistakes, only sooner. Now, why would she say that? Well, of course, because every mistake she would make sooner in her life, she'd be wiser and move along her life. So you can do no wrong. So if you're in a bad situation right now, or a tough situation, or life's kicking you in the teeth, look at the lessons you're supposed to be learning. Reflect on yourself and how you're showing up in the world. What is it within you that keeps attracting the situation in your life in order to learn the major lesson, to order to heal that major trauma so that it no longer shows up in your life because now you're wiser from it. That's what I got for you today. Love you guys so much and I'll see you in the next video. Peace.